Hello, this is a numerical from the filtration portion of the subject environmental engineering. Let's do it. At a small water treatment plant which has four filters, rate of filtration and backwashing are 200 meter cube per day per meter square and 1000 meter cube per day per meter square respectively. Backwashing is done for 15 minutes per day. The maturation which occurs initially as the filter is put back into service after cleaning take 30 minutes. It is proposed to recover the water being wasted during backwashing and maturation. The percentage increase in the filtered water produced up to two decimal places would be. So let's do it once. So first step is the rate of backwashing which is given as 1000 meter cube per day per meter square. It is already given. Next data which is given is Rate of filtration which is 200 meter cube per day per meter square. Next data is time for backwashing. It is also given for one day. It is it took 15 minutes for backwashing for one day 15 minutes per day. And next data is time for maturation. It is 30 minutes. It is also per day 15 minutes per day and 30 minutes per day for both backwashing and maturation. And the rate of backwashing the rate of filtration are also given. So the water wasted on backwashing and maturation is recovered which is in turn introduced an increase in filtered water. So it is already given in the problem that the water wasted on backwashing and maturation is put back into the tank itself filtration tank itself. So there will be an increase in the filtered water because of this recovery. So we need to find out what will be that percentage increase. So next percentage increase in filtered water. So what will be this is the question. What is the percentage increase in filtered water because of because we uh, we put back those backwashed water and uh, maturation water into the tank itself. Though so there will there is some increase in the filtered water. What is that amount? That is the question. So upon what data we need to take the percentage increase upon the volume of filtered water. Upon the volume of filtered water what is the increase in volume. What is that increase? The increase is the backwashed water plus maturation water. Why because of that the total water obtained from the tank after the filtration will be this filtered water plus backwashed water plus maturation water. What was the initial volume? If there is no if we are not uh, putting back this backwashed water and maturation water into the tank then that will be the filtered water itself. So this will be the increase in filtrate filtered water. So in effect we can write this numerator as volume of backwashed water plus maturation water itself because that is increase upon the filtered water. So we need to find each of these terms volume of backwashed water volume of maturation water volume of filtered water. So this volume of filtered water is the initial amount when when we got the uh, volume without putting the backward backwashed water and maturation water into the tank what we get just filtered water that is to be filtered water. If we are adding this backwashed water plus maturation water into this filtered volume that will be the final total volume. So our our problem is to find out the percentage increase in uh, filtered water. So we are doing in this way. So the first term we need to understand is volume of water used for backwashing. So it is already given that the rate of backwashing is 1000 meter cube per day per meter square and the duration of backwashing is 15 minutes. So multiply these two terms. Uh, so here it is 15 minutes but here it is meter cube per day per meter square. So we need to convert this 15 minutes into day so that uh, we will get uh, we can cancel out the units. So 15 minutes will be converted to day by 15 divided by 24 into 60. So the calculation will be uh, volume of water used for backwashing is 1500 by 144 meter cube per meter square per meter square. What is the volume? Okay. Next step is volume of water used for backwashing. Volume of water used for backwashing is oh sorry this is not for backwashing this is for maturation volume of water used for maturation uh, okay volume of water used for maturation uh, the rate of maturation 
uh, until and unless it is given that the volume of maturation, uh, sorry, rate of maturation is different, then take that rate of maturation as rate of filtration itself. So what is the rate of filtration? 200 meter cube per day per meter square. So that in do, the time taken for the backwashing is 30 minutes. Convert that 30 minutes into day. So 200 into 30 by 24 into 60. The answer will be 100 by 24 meter cube per meter square. So the next thing is volume of water filtered. So the rate of water filtration is 200 meter cube per day per meter square. Now we want to uh, know what is the duration of filtration. So all this uh, data is done for, all uh, this uh, clarif analysis is done for one day. So one day, how many minutes are there? 24 into 60 minutes are there. Within that, uh, 30 minutes are taken for backwashing and 50 minutes for maturation. So total 45 minutes is gone. So balance how many minutes are there that is taken for filtration. So 24 into 60 minutes, that is one day, minus 45 minutes will take the duration of filtration in minutes. Convert that into day, then we will get the answer as 13,950 divided by 72 meters cube per meter square. Now the percentage increase in filtered water, now we can calculate that. Volume of backwashed water plus volume of maturation water upon volume of filtered water into 100. That is, we already got these values. So, just this is just by calculation, okay. Uh, so, the ratio will be obtained like this. Uh, so, the final answer is 375 plus 150 divided by 6975 into 100. So, percentage increase in filtered water. Uh, we can obtain the value as 7.5 percentage. So this is the percentage increase in water. So this is the total numerical. Okay. So the answer, we obtained the answer. We got the answer. So uh, hope you all understood. Uh, and if you have any more doubts on this question or you have any doubts in any kind of question, just please comment. I can help you. Okay. Thank you. See you again.